Good afternoon, so it's the 30th of April today, so I've got three hauls in one today. I've got Iceland, B&M, and I've also got my Asda online shop coming later today. So I'm going to record my Iceland haul and my B&M, and I'll record my Asda when it comes, and I'll put all three on the same video today. So we've got, these are all Summer World meals mostly. So we've got some Summer World peel or rice and that will be free. So all the Summer World meals are free. Some teriyaki noodles. I've had that one before and really enjoyed it. Now these Iceland barbecue chicken skewers are half a cent per skewer. I don't think I've had those before, but they did come up in one of my videos that I did for new items in Iceland. So I'm looking forward to trying those. I've got some Chinese style chicken curry. So I'm gonna have that for my Saturday night tea tonight. Beef vindaloo. Chicken tikka masala, and then I thought this would be quite handy to have in the freezer. Chip shop curry sauce, so I can just add veg and chicken to that, and that make a nice, quick and easy meal during the week when I'm working. I've got one of the lunch bowls, the chicken tikka and rice there. And this one I thought looked really tasty as well, the salt and pepper chicken chow mein. So when the rest of the family's having something that's higher sin, I will get that out the freezer. Got some chicken sausages there. Got some roast potatoes. I'm not that keen on their chips or these roast potatoes, but I just thought that just before quickness, I thought it'd be quite handy to have in the freezer. I'm not at Iceland very often either, so it's good to pick these things up. Some pork sausages there as well. And then lastly, I've got some Warburton's wholemeal rolls there. One of those is still a healthy extra B. So I thought they'd be quite handy. I'm going to individually wrap those and pop them in the freezer for through the week. So that's everything I bought in Iceland and I'll now show you what I got in B&M. So here is the B&M haul and it's not all food this time. So I'll start at this side. So we've got some glasses there, large glasses, and they were £5. We've got some of these already and we use them a lot. So we have a dishwasher, so it means this is going to be more in the cupboard as we use them and as we're drinking more with the weather getting wet, better as well. I've got some Bliss caramelised biscuit flavour whipped bars. Now I've been trying to get my hands on these bars and I haven't been able to until today. So I've got three boxes there with one box um, to give away to my mum as well for her to try. So they are five sins each. I've also got some of these Bliss Indulgent Layers Banoffee bars. Again, haven't seen these ones yet. So I'm looking forward to trying those and they're four and a half cents each. The Skinny Dream Chocolate Peanut Bars. Can't remember if I've had these at all. So I've bought just the one box of those for four and a half cents. Wagon Wheels Orange and they are eight cents each for those. Uh, now I'm not that keen on Wagon Wheels so things like that would be really handy in the cupboard for the rest of the family. White chocolate blondies, again, I'm not that keen on these kind of things, so they're five and a half cents each, but the rest of the family will enjoy those. Teddy's chocolate orange, so one segment is two cents, and they're on a pound just now, so I bought that because that'll be a handy treat for the rest of the family after tea one night. Now, I bought this for, it's one of our paths that's quite dark. We do have quite a lot of lights in our garden, but there's just one bit that's a bit dark. So I've bought this two in one stainless steel wall light, with PIR sensor, bright white. Apparently they're really good, so I thought we'll give that a go. And I've bought three of these lights for on one of my trees in my back garden. It's a blossom tree. So I've had these before. I don't think they last that long, to be honest, because the rain seems to get in them, but they weren't dear. So I'll pop those out later to get some sunshine. A laundry box. Now I've seen these, I think I've seen these on it was either YouTube or Instagram. I usually just leave my washing powder in the box in the where the washing machine is because it's in a cupboard but I thought it looked much nicer in that so I bought that today. I bought this. Now this is supposed to be for cutlery but I'm going to use it for makeup and pop it in my cupboard. I thought that'd be quite handy because it's got some big sections in there and that'll keep my brushes and my foundation and things all separate so I'm going to try and be more organised so that's what I'm going to use for that. Some Lenore Exotic Bloom, I like the look of that, I think I've maybe had that before. I have no sense of smell so it's just really for the benefit of the rest of the family. I've not had a sense of smell for years but um, I'm sure it'll smell lovely. 
We've got some Tetley tea bags there and they are free obviously on Summer World. I can't find these Crave Sticks milk chocolate but the hazelnut ones are come up at five cents so I'm sure it'll be very similar because they're 101 calories for those. And then I bought these to put on our fence posts where we uh, have our driveways and they were £3 each and the lady that um, was on the till said they are really really bright so I'm looking forward to trying those because in the dark evenings I don't like reversing out of our driveway so I thought we'll get some of those and give those a go. A Maggie bag and this is the sweet and spicy Mexican one and that's six cents but again it'll do at least four of us so I'm fine with that. Now I bought this Unibond No More Nails removable strips. I kind of thought I might try using those to put these on the fence post but we will see. I'll have to read to see whether or not it goes on wood, not quite sure, but um, it was another impulse buy. And then lastly, I got a Maggie's Gloriously Tasty Garlic, the Juicy Chicken one, and that is four and a half cents for that. So that's everything I bought in B&M. And next I will show you my Asda haul. So here is haul number three, and it's an Asda online shop. Got some British white potatoes there. Thought I'd try those instead of paying for Maris Piper. So we'll give them a shot, see what they're like. So they are a free food. We've got a tender heart cabbage there. That is a speed food. Onion, speed food. Peppers, speed food. Iceberg lettuce, speed food. Beetroot, baby spinach and baby kale salad, speed foods. Two cucumbers, speed food. Some cherry tomatoes, speed food. Chestnut mushrooms, two packs of those, speed food. Some tender and crunchy trimmed fine beans. These were a substitute for sugar snap peas. So I like to take sugar snap peas just to, as they are raw and take them to work for a snack. But I don't think I'll be taking trimmed fine beans, but we will eat them anyway. So they are a speed food. Some vine ripened tomatoes, speed food. Grapes are a free food. Kiwi fruit, kiwi fruit, kiwi fruit are a speed food. No, they're not. Sorry, kiwi fruit are a free food. It's getting late at night. If we've got some royal gala apples, they are a speed food. Some penny pasta. I'm sorry, I had to put the lights on, and so everything's got a bit of a glare because it's starting to get dark here. So some Asda penny pasta. That is a free food. Mango fingers, a free food. I can't believe it's not butter. 25 grams is three cents. Some free range medium eggs there. They are free in protein. Some bagel thins, the soft seeded New York bagel thins are a healthy extra bee for one of those. Some rice, that is free. A creamy pepper sauce, four cents. Some grated mature cheddar, so I bought two packs of that. 30 grams is a healthy extra A or six cents. Weight Watchers wraps and they are still a healthy extra B for one of those. We've got some Asda cashews there. So 15 cashews is a healthy extra B or six and a half cents. Some Candarelle, so they are free. I'm not sure if you use more than two or three, whether you have to sin those, but I never sin mine. Some Asda mature cheddar. Now this isn't the pack that I ordered, but um, I think the family will have this finished in no time. 30 grams of that is a healthy extra eight or six cents. Weetabix with chocolate. Now, I did order two packs because I've ordered a pack for my mum as well and only one pack have come, so I've split it in two there. So two of these chocolate Weetabix is a healthy extra B. Love to have those in overnight Weetabix and I only usually have one because it makes quite a big quantity. Some banana chips, 25 grams is seven cents. Some sirloin steak, so as long as we remove the fat, that'll be free and protein. I've got some chicken breast fillets, two lots there, and they will be free and protein. And some naked bacon there, and as long as we remove the fat, that'll be free and protein as well. I've got some Nesquik milk there, three tablespoons is three cents. Squirty cream, 12.5 grams is two cents. And I bought a couple of naked noodles. So the chow mein one is two and a half cents. The sweet chilli is three cents. Mellow birds, I've actually run out of my mellow birds and I'm really enjoying them. It's like a flashback to when I, when I was young. So mellow birds will be free. Some white pepper, ground white pepper, that will be free. Some sarsen's malt vinegar, that will be free. Some Caesar salad dressing, 
One tablespoon is three and a half sins. Then we've got some juice here, so lemon and lime zero, and two Pepsi Max, no caffeine, and they will both be free. And then we're lastly on semi-skimmed milk, so 250 mils is a healthy extra A. So that is everything this week in haul number three. And that is the cupboards well and truly stocked for the week ahead. Thank you again for watching. If you haven't already subscribed, it'd be great if you'd like to subscribe. It's free to do so. And any comments down below, I always answer. Thanks again. See you next time. Bye.